I actually don't even have a crazy intro because the person <laughs> who I was going to throw under the bus because of the information that one of their members told me uh-huh. is not here. Oh, are you kwa pa kujitetea? No, he's not. However, I just know if I was ever in a gunfight and a gun was pulled on Mad Tracks, he uh-huh. would snitch on the whole squad. <laughs> If he was ever asked like which one of these members uh-huh. does XYZ yeah, Maggie is the, yes he's the snitch <laughs> and I'm not even lying Why? <laughs> Why? Okay so I was watching this interview Okay and they asked like what's something about Major we don't know and he was saying how Major goes up and down the stairs by the time you even get to the crib <laughs> you need to have called him before you left the house to confirm sure. cuz he goes up and down the stairs to confirm he's locked oh, to confirm wow. he's right, wearing the right shoes I love for midway to and I confirm kama do imefungwa so wow. i was just like wow okay. you're a snitch nah, wha- but what is true ali sababu venye iko it's so true it's that's like really, OCD. that's his, really how he operates all the time and he always takes the stairs apparently yeah he doesn't he doesn't do lifts okay and uh yeah he it's just ocd on another level okay so, so we're going to he needs s- to check if the cooker was switched off if you know He has, like that. he just has paranoia on yeah, another level. On another level, but he's uh yeah, but then now, you know, once once the nene is in the system, mm-hmm. hey, no tell him will it. Wow, Maddie. Wow, I see like marriage life is treating you different. Look at you. Not not much has changed. Well, uh yeah, there's uh, not a golden thing mm-hmm. on my finger. Apart from that, yes. Uh yeah, you know, two kids. Enjoying it. I'm enjoying it but my kids are terrorists. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Do they know that is every, famous? Want to join that new uh, famous? Everything is up for grabs. <laughs> wow, wow. Like they grab everything. Wow. Jeez. Yeah, this is the <laughs> but, touching everything. But this is part of like the life of like adulting that we were never prepared for. Mm-hmm. However, never. we want to change the tone. We want to have a little bit of fun. Welcome to the show, Cora. You <laughs> also bo- you also brought in somebody from Zambia. Yeah. Jay and uh we're going to be uh Bomb. chopping it up with yep. him. However, we start things off on the show on a very a uh, fun note. We have a game called the warm up yes. where we get to know the fun side of you guys. So the rule is there's a cup in front of you, there's some questions. Mm-hmm. All you got to do is dip your hand into the bowl read out the question and of course go ahead and answer it if you don't want to answer it you can choose another question no. tell us something we do not know about <laughs> my tracks major or cora so now you have to snitch on our on cora uh-huh. what do i what do i cora so cora uh-huh. is a bad man <laughs> on, on the on the barbecue okay oh, the nice there nice there this dude okay uh-huh. uh anytime you hear there's a barbecue at their dig yeah you guy you're there inside and then i hear these days he's doing cocktails uh-huh. hey, this guy, <laughs> this guy. <laughs> <laughs> so kokora is a bad man on the barbecue oh, nice. and it was yam choms nice. marinated g12 hours uh-huh. you know <laughs> <laughs> it was basted <laughs> it was hey this guy is a bad man <laughs> nice <laughs> okay how about kokora yeah. what would you say something about madi we do not know uh what do oh my gosh huh. <laughs> <laughs> madi is a good father He's a very good father. That's what's and he's a, he's, a, oh he's, he's a good oh, husband. But he had to be sweet. <laughs> <laughs> I, I was like I was too sweet. Yeah. Yeah. He's been he's too he's sweet, man. But you don't know something. Uh-huh. You don't know and and he doesn't like he doesn't like having his clothes on. He Never go with this guy to a hotel. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey, Boom. hey, okay. Boom. Is that really the truth, Muddy? Boom. No, <laughs> I know what he's referencing. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, look, it was a huge mistake. <laughs> okay. And it happened only once. So Ali Nasemaje, what's a life hack every Kenyan needs to know about? Man, a life hack. Mm-hmm. A life hack every Kenyan needs to know about. Um, um it could be about the anything. easiest way to peel is on any eye tubes mm-hmm. with a small spoon. Oh, I used to do that in in in, 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 in um he means yeah. you know what iTubes like are. My boyro, you know. Yeah. Oh, iTubes. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> 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 iTubes. 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 Eggs. Okay. iTubes. Yes, uh-huh. with a small spoon. Yeah. Crack uh-huh. it, put it in. Sure. sure. I'll show you better than I can tell you, but yeah, that's only hack I know. Okay. okay. Yeah. Yeah. Sour so, muddy. Pinch the tip. Uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Back to the music. <laughs> This is the point where we have to just go back to the music. Wow, buddy, surely. Wow. That was going to be shake before you use but Is that is that before you said it like accelerate? Have you heard of a song? Have you heard of a song and you're like I wish I wrote that or I wish I was featured on it? Yeah. 
Ooh. Uh, yeah. Which song? Mostly it's like adverts because they make so much money. You know? Oh, oh wow. Yeah, like, mm-hmm. You know, True. like when I, whenever I hear an advert, I'm like, man, I could have made it something better. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. So it's mostly adverts. It's mostly about which, money. Otherwise, you know. Which co- advert? Coke? Which, which, which advert? Mm-hmm. Uh, which one has made the most money this year? Oh wow! <laughs> <laughs> About you, Cora, is there any uh, record you've ever heard and you're like, I want, I man. wish I was on that record? Yeah, there's so many. I just can't think of it. Uh, there was Kunadawa. I, I, oh. I, I, I loved what? Kunadawa, bro. I wanted to be on Kunadawa <laughs> so bad. Yeah. I wish I was like, that song was so nice. There was Kunadawa. There was what? Uh, I love necessary noise songs, like the fast necessary noise. Mm-hmm. Album. Oh my mm. god! I just like. But don't you feel like you're on those records because of your brother? Like an extension of you is there. Well, well, to some extent, but I mean, I don't know about that. But uh, yeah, and okay, so now I can also say Maisha by Isa. Ah, mm. okay, that, that's that, a good record. Oh, that, yeah, record yeah. That, that as well. That okay. Actually, that's like that song and a song called Dunda. That's when I decided I'm gonna do music. Okay. That's pretty dope. That's pretty dope. I just want to ask you this. We played a lot of collabos from you guys. Yeah. And uh, when we had Nameless on the show, he talked about uh, Mad Tracks. You telling him, Asilete um, humbleness <laughs> kongo mamo tuwa kuotemba. Those are exact words. Akisema, akisema, alingia studio Mad Tracks. Akamambia, namoski, usilete humbleness kwa itra. Hii pep talk ni lazima kwa each artist ama kuna enda No, it depends. It depends on the track, yeah. Mm-hmm. But uh, you see the thing about Nameless. Nameless is a legend and he, d- he doesn't he doesn't realize it. Mm-hmm. You get what I mean? I guess because he looks at himself in the mirror every day, but he doesn't realize how much he's influenced right. all the artists who are out right now and the artists to come in the future. You mm-hmm. get what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So he's uh, he's a bit like uh, Daudi Kabaka for the new generation. Yeah. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yep. And uh, is there any other artist who you've uh, had to like uh, give a particular direction on a track because um, they were not like going with the flow the way you all wanted... Um, the song to go um not oh vivian yeah oh that's very interesting because we discussed that record like okay. um personally i felt like her vocals could have been ten thousand better uh-huh. i don't know personally that's what i feel yeah so how much direction did you guys have to give her on that so, record so basically we told her to rap mm-hmm. we told her to rap um and this was our first collabo with yeah. a female with a female mm-hmm um, and so, w- of course, she has her audience, mm-hmm. and she was like, "Okay, I'm gonna rap, but I'm not gonna rap throughout the whole song. Mm. Um, I'm gonna get to a point where I need to let my females know that I'm still in the building." Mm-hmm. And so now that's when she breaks out into into yes. her vocals. But okay. for the rap bit, I think she murdered it. Okay. Mm-hmm. And then now she came in with her own flavor, mm-hmm. which now pulls in all the ladies. I don't know, you're a lady. You tell me. Um. Do, so did she write her own? Yeah. Rap really? Yeah. Okay, okay, that's pretty dope. And yeah. uh, now you've crossed over. You're working with artists now from even Zambia. Yep. Um, walk us through that record or how the conversation even came about with J Rock. So um, yeah, first of all, yeah, everybody listening out there, I'm here with J Rocks from Zambia. Yeah, yep. Huge artist, huge artist in Zambia. Uh, he used to be in a group called Zone Fam. Do you want to explain this? Oh, Let yeah. me explain yeah. this, ladies yeah. and gentlemen. J Rocks. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> bro. How you doing, bro? Uh, you're good. I'm, I'm good. I'm right, good. Salimia yeah. wa Kenya. Say hi to the fans. They're listening to you. Yeah, right yeah. Now. How you, how you guys doing? Uh, it feels good to be back. You know, I, I, I used to come here a lot. Mm-hmm. You know, but I haven't been here in a while. Uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm back in the, in the building, just with a whole different face. You know, because I'm not with the guys anymore. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but yeah, the music, you know, is still very much alive. Uh, the brand is still very much alive. Nope. And uh, we're, I, I feel like the brand is strong enough now, like uh, Southern Africa. Uh, the music is playing everywhere now, you know. So um, I think I'm at, I'm at a good place now. How you know? did you get to know about the council? Um, you see, me and me and Madi uh, have been, you know, talking for the longest time. You mm-hmm. know, uh, trying to get like the the right record done, uh, but things didn't work. You know, uh, at uh, the, the the time we started talking, and um, I, I believe in 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 you know just waiting for time yeah, to do right its thing. Time. You know, the yeah. right the the right time and the the right type of record. So uh, when I was in studio, um, I'm working on my on my uh, fourth studio album, and. Um, 
I I I we cooked up something me and my my producer and I felt like yo this this just needs like a East African touch. Mm. And uh, the person that just came to my mind was yo this is the song. So I got in touch with him and I was like dude we need to record the song. So I I sent through the song. He he listened to it and the moment he just listened to it he's like he was like yo I I feel like this is the song. And that's yes. how we started working on the song. And I feel like videos are very important uh mm. in this day and age. So we we decided to say you know what if we're going to to get the song done we might as well uh, shoot a video for mm-hmm. it and that's that's why i'm here okay. you know um to get the video done oh, Cora, is the video going to be like how your um current videos are of you guys just dancing on the street is that the mm-hmm. vibe of the video i think the best person to explain this video is probably muddy oh <laughs> really <laughs> for real well, muddy are you muddy a creative director you play like tanasha donna now uh, i've been seeing how she's a creative director for videos uh-huh z cora just doesn't like whatsapp groups oh really <laughs> let me tell you the script is on the it's on the it's on the group the script is there in pdf format yeah. pictures uh-huh. everything yeah I'm doing so this guy just doesn't even yeah, like yeah, the groups yeah. Yeah. you know even that the last group he <laughs> was still the same so no basically won't be the same uh-huh. uh, now that now that j-rox is here mm-hmm. uh, we're gonna we're gonna do something real big you see when it came to accelerator mm-hmm. and uh n- new position mm-hmm. that song fit the videos mm-hmm. as we shot them okay for this other song uh we you know it's gonna fit what 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 the, what the song's about okay mm. now are you guys ever um because you've been in the game for a while you yeah. have been making us this music that's all about a movement for a while mm-hmm. do you guys get ever caught up in like the comment section of really reading what people have to say or you're just too caught up in the making of music and next yeah you so don't care me, about the I'm, comments I only care about the thumbs uh-huh. mm-hmm. so the thumbs up and the thumbs down that's okay. all I care about okay. I, I don't I don't read the comments mm-hmm. um, but I bet there are really good comments out there and really <laughs> bad ones I used ones. to read them but yeah mm-hmm. so oh Madi used to like, read them I, I'm saying I used to read them oh story. okay I, I, I don't read them oh you don't read uh, them um, no, no 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 so you're very confident in your music regardless of what people have to say yeah I guess you have to have a certain level of confidence when yeah. you're releasing a song okay. but you never know you okay. see so mm-hmm. the, you know the judge the judge and jury and still and what if the thumbs there. down are more than the thumbs up uh then you know i'm still happy <laughs> <laughs> it's still I a hit record uh, yeah if i i i drove an emotion yes yeah. yes so i'd rather they click on the thumb up or down mm-hmm. rather than just be like huh, and then go to the next thing uh-huh what else? What else, man? Which are the exclusive <laughs> tracks you come with? Just, just tell us. You it. guys. Just tell us. Like, it. we've just literally given you the water. <laughs> no. <laughs> so I'm going to take another water. Another one. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm to I mean, th- No, it's the way you casually said it. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> so <laughs> I mean, I watched an interview that you guys said you were going to put out, like, four records this year. Yeah. Is uh, that, are, are we done? No. no okay. <laughs> okay, <laughs> great, great, so great, great. We're not done. Because when I watched that interview, I was, like, trying to calm down, and I was like, I feel like the council still has more like there's still more <laughs> months to go which yeah. are the artists are you guys going to be collaborating with um yeah well it depends it depends on who's serious we've done so many collabs okay um so it depends on who's serious about releasing them right now um we have a couple of tracks that we want to do as a council because mm-hmm. um, we've been doing collabs from the beginning of the year mm-hmm. we haven't done a song as the council uh-huh so when we started with um ochungulo family yes and then we followed up with Sudi Boy mm-hmm. and Vivian mm-hmm. and King Kaka mm-hmm. and J-Rox. Mm-hmm. Uh, they still more collabs, but mm-hmm. we're looking at doing something just as the council. Okay. 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 And and I like the fact that uh, anytime I hear the council, you always the your music is always fresh ahead of its time uh, from the days of Boda Boda. This <laughs> 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 how I come and I, I'm saying it with my chest, Bila Woga. And I like the fact that uh, Sai 2019 new different kind of sounds, Gengeton. Uh, Debe by Chris Kaiga, uh, Dabonga by The Sailors, yeah, and all yeah. these amazing sounds coming out of um, Kenya right now. And uh, this revolution, unajua kuna wengine wana say it shouldn't be televised, wengine wana say it shouldn't be um, put out there for the world, or uh, this uh, type of music is attached to some type of um, stereotypes. Say, yeah, stereotypes. I'm tani, unajua. What do you mean? What, what I, I've, do you I've, I've, I've been hearing this but it's so crazy to me mm, yeah. yeah actually it just pisses me off yeah yeah, yeah. just talk your you talk bro you guys listen to dance all, all the time what are they talking about in their in their music those guys are from 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 what they call it Gaza mm-hmm. 
yeah. whatever, even whatever, even someone said, said the other day about the, the what it's the topics that uh, these guys are talking about or the things that we are talking about are yeah. too sexual or too what? Mm. Too sexual, dance all is sexual, Nicki Minaj is sexual, Drake is sexual. Mm-hmm. You guys still play that music all the time. Mm-hmm. Yeah. When it comes to our boys and these guys who are really now becoming superstars out of yeah, this yeah. thing, it's, it's like a problem. Oh, step back, you shouldn't mm. be doing this. Trying to put our own people in a box yeah. and then putting these other guys that out there to say, yo, let's celebrate these Nigerians who come here and do all the same thing that we're doing in a different language. Mm-hmm. It's so Crazy. pathetic. Never, we shouldn't be putting these guys in a box. Mm-hmm. Our creativity shouldn't be put in a box. Mm-hmm. You cannot just let the guys do and talk about what they want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. True. That's what I have to say. I, mean. I like that. Yeah, and me. <laughs> <laughs> he's basically, yeah, yeah, he's he's basically, he said, he said it. <laughs> <laughs> my dear, my political. He said, it, he said it. Let's just stop being. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Let's not be contribute. hypocrites, Yani. Mm. Seriously, because you know what you guys do when mm. you go to the club. Muna jazi le tabiazenu, madam chini ameza kichwe kuchini ameza na nini? Alafu my boys, muna omba madam tunajua tu. Mm. So you guys just speak you on it. You just yeah. sing on it. If that's what that's what the society is right now. And yes. That's what it is. So if we're, if we're gonna fake it, if we can't talk about it, mm. it's fake. And I have to say that ish, I wasn't ready for this kind of vibes from no, the council. No, like I've no. always known the council brings like vibes. Yeah. Yeah. But it's always dope to know that they can elevate those vibes. Mm-hmm, they can take you them know? a notch higher. They can take <laughs> like I can't even wait for the next artist they're gonna collab with. I mean they've already given us the next record, but yeah. even the next one. Oh. Ready. <laughs> ready. 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 We we we're were ready. just gobbling them up. I mean, cause the scene right now is really, really loving so, them. No, so I just book a seat here. Uh huh. Because now this is going to be very How are we regular. going to get out of the studio? <laughs> <laughs> Do we even need to get out of here? Yeah. Yeah. It seems Our like we'll be so here. Big now. Cash no. <laughs> <laughs> so we want to wrap up the warm up as you guys uh, wrap things up right here on the interview. So you guys already know the rules to the questions in the cup. Yes. Oh. Yeah. So we're going back there. Uh, don't be that guy. Uh, do you do you think you have put on uh, put out a bad song? No. Yes, I think with that one you already established. They have no. never put on a bad song. Is that guy who would say yes? Is this is an artist who would say yes? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he'd be like, I didn't like this person on the uh, collabo record. Maybe. I don't uh, know. You never know. You know. What's your favorite holiday? Man, say me, I work too much. I've seen Dangi holiday. When's the last time I went for holiday? God damn. Like, even which public holiday is your favorite? Mm. Oh, you mean like that? Yeah. Mashuja, probably. Okay. Okay. Of course, Christmas. Okay. Muddy, do you have any favorite holidays? Uh, No. Wow. <laughs> Christmas. <laughs> Not even 420, but okay. Oh, is that a holiday? That's you can, for you. You can, you can make it into a <laughs> holiday. That's, that's how I know. <laughs> <laughs> Don't ever offer me cookies on 420. Wow. <laughs> sounds, why sounds why like are you coming for me? The one who said 420. No one here was about 420. It's you. So, my dear. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> so, guys, uh, before to watch Muende, man, there's something yeah. here we do on the show where we allow artists to confess something they want to possess, especially remaining of the year. Trafficker halfway throughout the year. Mm-hmm. So, we usually want you all to manifest for the remaining of the year. We've had, um, we had Walt Shifaya here who said he'd like to win a Grammy. So, guys, I just want you to manifest each of you. Alafu was the cancel. Um, yeah. Uh, right now, I'm just thinking about that S class. Okay. Nice. 2015. Uh, okay. Mm. 2015, nice. no, 2016, actually. Okay. Okay. Uh-huh. So that's, that's, why, that's, why, that's why we're headed. Ah, nice. Cora? Um, you know, health and wealth for my baby boy nice. and my family. Ah, Chicky, he's making uh, me look bad. Uh, no, 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 I want a Japanese kind of love. Me, I'm going to Japan to find love. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I keep telling these guys I'm going to He's Japan. Been talking about I'm them. tired of you Nairobi women. Oh, what did we I'm do? I'm tired. Oh. We're tired. We are, we are, we are apologies. You guys are too tough. You're 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 too tough. I keep this telling my dear, I'm going to like, Japan. Why do you feel like you'll find love in Japan? I'm going to find a chick who's called Toyota something. Nakamura. Ah, bro. Are you, re- are you ready for the food ah. delicacies? Uko tayari? Ah, I mean, I'm ready, bro. Japan has some... Yeah, I'm coming. I'm coming, baby. I'm coming. 